Hey, what's up guys? It's Lucas and welcome back to my channel. If you haven't subscribed, scroll down, click the subscribe button. It really helps me out. All the social media stuff will be in the description. If you'd like to support the channel, you can buy me a coffee at buymeacoffee.com slash lucasapp89. So if you've been following the Les Paul special mod project I undertook, uh, or I should say my wife and I undertook uh, a couple of weeks ago, I think it's been a couple of weeks now, um, then this is kind of the finale to that. Um, this guitar is more or less what it's going to be. The only thing I may possibly change are the knobs to something. Uh, actually, uh, one of you guys uh, commenters suggested a uh, kind of cool retro looking amp knob and I was like, ooh, that's really neat. So I might get some of those and put some of those on it. But other than that, uh, I'm pretty much going to leave this the way it is. And I think it came out really, really cool. It does look like a trash can, which I enjoy. So today we're actually using my uh, Carvin SX100, which is a solid state amplifier. Um, which is it's you know not what I would usually use, but uh, in particular I think this is a really good sounding little solid state amplifier. It's 100 watts. Um, it's got two channels, but in this case, case all I'm using is the uh, clean channel, and I uh, I did change the speaker in that combo to a uh, EV12L, like an old EV12L from the late 70s or something like that that I just happen to have, um, and um, it's a pretty good sounding little amp actually. Um, so like I said, I'm just using a clean channel, so what you're going to hear here is all the like distortion, overdrive, delay, reverb, all that kind of stuff is going to be coming from my kind of like little prototype pedal board here. And um, we'll get into more into that in another video, but basically what I'm going to do is just play some kind of cleanish stuff and then I'll kind of amp up the drive and go a little harder, a little harder, a little harder, and you can kind of hear what the guitar sounds like and let me know what you think. <laughs>
you go. That's my Gibson Les Paul special project. Um, I like to do this kind of project. I think it's a lot of fun. It's very rewarding in the end, and it kind of like really bonds you with the instrument. You know, like you feel like you put a part of yourself into it. This is a really cool guitar. Um, it's got a unique sound. It feels nice. It stays in tune really well. So, what's well, not to like? So, unless you just don't like the finish, in which case, okay, I get it. You just don't like the finish. Anyway, I hope this has been fun and enjoyable for you. Like I said, if you were interested about more of the stuff that went into this guitar, you can watch the other parts. You can kind of see me take it apart and do some work on it and stuff like that. Um, so I'll leave links to those videos in the description. And But otherwise, thank you so much for watching, and I will uh, catch you later.